Hey folks, this is King of Tunes, and today I'm going to talk about the 2016 Powerpuff Girls. And, um, um, Powerpuff Girls Part 2, excuse me. Uh, and before I start this video, I want y'all to watch my Powerpuff Girls 2016 Part 1 before you watch Part 2. Now, let's start the freaking video. The Powerpuff Girls was one of the most successful shows on Cartoon Network of all time. The show ran from 1998 to 2005, with a total of 6 seasons, some specials, and a theatrical movie, and it sold lots of merchandise. But after 11 years since the show was cancelled, in 2014, the Pop-Off Girls came back as a special, and was created by the same person who did the original. His name is Craig McCracken. He came back to do a special for the Pop-Off Girls. Called the uh, Pop of Girls Dance Pants Revolution. To me, it wasn't that interesting, but then Cartoon Network w wanted more, and that's when they made the Pop of Girls 2016. This time, it didn't have a creator. You know, the creator for the original Pop of Girls? It didn't have him in there. And that's why I'm doing part two, since there is no, since there is so many mistakes they have done and so many dumb decisions so that's why that's why i'm doing part two so let's get started so where can i start with well the animation looks horrible lazy and so many animation mistakes in every episode and dumb decisions have been made like uh writing off miss bellum and you barely see Mojo as the villain, and now you get to the point that Mojo is a transgender. Why is Mojo Mo Why is Mojo a transgender? He wasn't transgender in the original. Well, sometimes, but but not all the time. The new Pop of Girls is a disgrace to the original, but there are some good things about it. Like there are some good action scenes. And the sh in the show, and the intro was good. Was good. Yeah, it was good, but like it's like somehow the show is just oh, it really makes me cringe. And the show is not even all that great. The animation sucks. And oh my goodness. I don't know what I don't know what else I don't know what else to say about the series. Um uh um I think it's uh wait hey, well the series like you know they have now they announced like they wrote off Miss Bellum. Um they well, I can say the intro's good too, but like, um, you know, like the art for the intro, it's good. I like it. Um, I'm trying to think of something that from like the intro. Um, let's see. Um, I think I I, I think like the um, I like like all the monster designs for like all the villains like. Like the, all the villains that are fighting the Powerpuff Girls, I like the the monster. I like the like the the character designs for the villains, like um, the villains that are fighting the the power the Powerpuff Girls. Um, uh, uh, they they did well. Well, the background kind of looks good, but like the background characters for the for the show is not good. I don't like it. Um. Let's see, uh, I think, uh, the, um, um, I think, so, uh, I'm trying to, th sorry folks, I'm trying to think of something about the series, um, man, my brain is losing, losing ideas, like, I know it's in there, but, you know, <laughs> you get the point, um, uh, the pop of girls, or oh, I could say, man, but it, I, I really miss that, that lovely art style that they had in the original, uh, uh, capture that Hannibal Barra feel, and, you know, 
you know, from, like, those old cartoons, uh, and, yeah, like, those old cartoons, like, they aired on Boomerang, but, yeah, you know, Boomerang's gone now, I mean, well, it's not gone, not literally, but, you know, um, it's really gone, <laughs> well, not re really gone, is is it rebranded, like, a month ago, so, well, not a month ago, a year ago, my bad, um, yeah, but I'll do a review on Boomerang another time, like, but, um, the Pop-Up Girls, well, I could say, it's, uh, man, I'm trying to think of something else good for the series, but I can't, it's just horrible. The, oh, I could talk about the voice actors, the voice actors, well, they're good. I mean, they're good. They sound like they're original. I've, well, my opinion, like, I watched plenty of views, reviews on YouTube, and, like, they said the voice actors doesn't sound like they're original, which I kind of agree with, because, like, uh, um, Buttercub, Buttercub has, has her voice a little deeper. I don't think it's supposed to be a little deeper, so... <laughs> And the blossom, blossom sounds good. And um, who else? Man, what's her name? Blossom. Buttercup. Buttercup. And um, bubbles. Yeah, bubbles sound the same too. So yeah, but the butter um buttercup is the only one that doesn't sound the same as the original voice actor that voiced Buttercup. So, we... Okay, so, doing with that, you know, um, yeah, that's all I want to talk about. And I hope you like this video. Please leave a comment down below, and please subscribe.